here are the two trades we ended up taking today. Now, of course, one happened at 9.30. Right, just before the US opened, so it's called high risk, right? A little bit higher risk here. You can see that pattern here. Right? We had the we had the move here below the thirty three hundred. And of course on that one here we got fifteen ticks of profit, even with only one contract, right? That's hundred and fifty USD. Then the second move happened here, right? We took another trade after the dollar index had bounced again. You see the euro, the first move came right back up, and then it gave us another entry below the same swing low there. This one, of course, an hour later, 3301 was the entry here. This one, of course, came down at one point, had us with 45 ticks of profit. Now, it bounced back up. I ended up flattening this thing at 20 ticks of profit, uh, 22 ticks of profit, I think it was. But that was, of course, after it had already gone 45 ticks down. Remember, one of the most important things we learned today was where to place those profit targets. And if you guys are with us this morning, we talked about how right this area here, that 3280 level, great spot to take profit. The 3250 level, another great stuff, another great stuff place to take profit. If you're taking a one contract trade, you kind of got your options limited, so you want to go ahead and take profit at the next level of support. So if you're taking one contract today, your profit here would be taken at 3280. If you're trading multiple contracts, as you can see, you'd still be waiting right now to fill that 60 tick final contract position. Okay, so you see down bottom here, that 60 tick target here, 3237 was that final target. So 3237 was the final target. We expect this trade to actually finish up here towards the end of the day today here at 3237 at the lows. So the final target would be from one extreme all the way down to the next. All right, guys? So those are the two trades we took there on the euro, both of the DX pattern short, both of which gave us ample amounts of profitability. And again, we got more information coming out for you guys next week in that members-only webinar. Now, of course, we got one trade on the scalp method today, 10.51, just before 11 o'clock. We really, like I said, didn't have much chance to grab very much today. We had what felt like a Friday that kind of skipped us. By the time we started to see things really shaking up here, but by the time things were starting to move here, it was pretty much towards the end of the morning here. On a Friday, we know to be very careful about that. 10.51, a two-step pattern, right? I'm sorry, this is, of course, not a two-step pattern short here. This is a, right, a, a breaker pattern long, excuse me, 84 was the fill, plus 4 plus eight and plus three. So short term trend is up. Again, this is not a two step, right? This is a breaker pattern long, right? Breaker long here. And so we're gonna go above the red line, mark up our swing high, break above that swing high, going with the trend of the upside. We took profit here at plus four, we took profit here at plus eight, and then you can see it came right back down, right, bounced right back down here, collapsed the downside, and we got taken out at our entry plus three. Right, two off at four, one off at eight, one off at three on four contracts, ten bucks a tick. That's nineteen ticks or hundred ninety USD. So, guys, nineteen ticks in the scout method. We're still demoing the DX pattern this week. Of course, we took about you know twenty eight, thirty ticks out of the demo this morning here on the DX. And next week, we'll be trading full time on that on that DX pattern. So, make sure you guys come back and join us on Monday. Now, Monday, May third, new month. We got a bank holiday in, in the uh, in, in Europe. Uh, specifically, I recall it's a UK bank holiday, so we're still open in the US. But of course, in the UK, get a bank holiday. Might be a slow start to the Monday morning. 8.30 personal income, 10 o'clock ISM, and 10 o'clock construction spending. And then another tips and tricks webinar at 11.30 Eastern Time. So make sure you guys are here for that. We'll be here for, might be a slow start Monday morning. If you guys are taking the day off on Monday, have a great holiday. If you guys are in the UK. And as always, we'll see you guys back here on Monday morning at 7.45. So we'll open up the room at 7.45. We'll do our webinars on Tuesday and Thursday next week. So next Tuesday and Thursday, free webinars. The beginner's course is always recommended for all you new traders out there, guys. The beginner's course is a perfect place to get started. And as always, if you want more information about our lifetime membership, that's sales at schooloftrade.com or toll-free 800-381-2084. It's been a great week. Almost $2,000 this week out of the room, guys, for contracts. We're just getting started. We'll see you guys next Monday. New month, new patterns. Very exciting. My name is Joseph James. We'll see you guys then. Bye-bye for now.